So what we're looking at now is Panorama View, which um, Nintendo claims was at the uh, E3 event, but uh, unfortunately we never got a chance to see it at that point. So this is brand new for us. Um, in a nutshell, you can see on the TV is um, just a car driving, or what we think is a car driving uh, along the streets. And from here, you can actually get a more interactive view where you can actually just kind of uh, rotate and see basically all sides of the street. Think of it as like a real-time Google Street View. And it goes up. And it can go down. The interesting thing is, no matter how far I go down, I can never, ever see the, uh, the driver in question. Um, also, if I actually did rotate like this in a car, I'd probably be dead at this point. So the last thing we're going to look at is the HD experience. Um, what we're seeing here is basically an example of what the Wii U's power is going to be capable of, whereas the Wii was decidedly more of a standard definition console. Uh, this time around, Nintendo wants to emphasize um, it's capable of 1080p HD, true HD graphics. Um, so what we're seeing here is a very high quality uh, Legend of Zelda demo. It's actually basically everyone's dream. And when we first saw E3, everyone's question was, is this going to be an actual game? Nintendo won't say that, but they will let you watch the demo over and over again. If we have a lot of controls around. We can use the uh, stick to adjust the camera angle uh, ever so slightly. But with the camera button, we can actually completely dramatically change where the scene is happening. Additionally, with the, uh, with the light, we can change the entire thing from night to day. Remember, all this is happening in real time. Um, and you can see, especially in nighttime, you can see how the light is bouncing off everything, especially Navi kind of flying around there. Uh, the last thing to show around where you can see is where the camera, where Link, and where the boss is. If we hit this button here, we'll actually take the entire video feed and we'll move it here. It's actually a mirror of what you see on screen. They moved the map on the screen as well, but they're also showing both videos at the same time. You can see it's the exact same picture being output. No change in the frame rate, it's all still very smooth. Uh, lighting is gorgeous. And there you have it. Let's give Link a break.